Today I'm going to be sharing five tips to evoke that sexiness in your space to give you that warm date night like um, ambience in your space and <laughs> keeping that very intimate connection between you and your spouse in your home or space so stay tuned to the end of the video to find out five tips i'll be sharing today first tip today will be being very bold about your warm colors and i'm going to pick one warm color which is the color red i would advise you try and buy accessories tiny items and then throw pillows you know and that have detailing of the color red on it and that's something that would spike up something in the space for that ambience well. Tip number two will be set the mood with lighting. So, I mean, I'm going to give you an example. So let's say you're on a date with someone and you're walking to your restaurant. If you've ever noticed this, please indicate in the comment section and tell me um, the colors of lights you've noticed in most restaurants that you've had dates in or, have, or, or you've probably had dinner in in a while. Bow back, brother. So I'm going to give you an example of what I mean when I mean setting the mood with lighting or setting the, setting up your space with lighting. When um, when you go for dinner in a restaurant or you're on a date in a restaurant, if you notice the lighting in that restaurant or space is usually very warm and not cool or bright. It's really very warm it's always um, yellow like or um, very dim like um, for me I really like going very dim in regards to lighting um, especially when I'm on a date and I would suggest you you know try and add um, red lights you know it works it's people get that vibe most times <laughs> that it's probably too much but I don't think it is so try to add like some red lights and then um keep it really warm and dim yellow lights always work so you can switch up lighting and then probably get like a um, floor lamp or um table lamp somewhere in the corner that you know kind of warms up the space and that should be the only lighting source in that my tech tip we have to do with texture and you know fabrics and texture i do always advise and i love the idea of going with leather something soft very smooth um leather no pimpled leather i'll put up pictures somewhere and then another alternative to that is going very um going very, very soft with suede as well or just gentle silk and um linear fabrics on your throw pillows or um could be but yeah mostly on the throw pillows or or you could do that with the if you have um drapes curtains you can go very soft with that as well so try going super soft and see how that works for you my fourth tip is for you to make it about a view you know so if you have like french windows or uh, windows that are literally very open and big please leave them open um um, shift your blinds or your drapes just expose your windows let the night sky come in or it could be the, could, that day could be actually happening during the day just bring in a lot of sky into that room that view is always amazing the stars the moon the sky you know bring that in if you don't have if you're not um, fortunate to have that i mean it's, oh, i always believe in taking advantage of whatever you currently have in that space so this goes for people who have like really big windows and then you know optimizing that in that space so another option to that is creating a view and you can do that by having like an art portrait that properly showcases your wild side or you could also go ahead and probably um stage something up together you know put maybe accessories in a certain um, focal point where you and your date's eyes would meet when you're in that space and then you guys can your attention is drawn to it always from um, every now and then while you're conversing during that date you know just try to create something visually pleasing in that space find a spot could be usually I always 
um, focus on finding out where the focal point of the room is. So if you don't have big windows that you can utilize, even if you have small windows, just leave your windows open and still walk around finding out your point of interest and most especially your focal point in that space because that is where both you and your date would literally um, focus on most of the time when your eyes don't meet. So my final tip will be to evoke emotions through art. So it could be art pieces like portraits, it could be um, sculptures, you know, something that has a little bit of curves and lines, you know, beautiful lines shaped properly. And then um, it could be black and white portraits, it could be um, an expression of what you like, you know being portrayed in that piece hung on the wall or placed in a corner or on the coffee table just sculptures and art pieces evoking emotions through that so you should consider shopping or talking to an artist to illustrate something beautiful and more um, morally unique more unique to you in and your space because I'm nice I'm going to give you an additional tip to um, add to the five I've given you already so before I give you that tip I would want to count to three and I want you to subscribe one two three and then I want to count to three again and I want you to click the like button one two three thank you so now the additional tip I would like you to get points or take points from the sexy black dress now you could like we all know black is a very dramatic color and can be very classy you know in fact it is not even can it's a very classy color it's a canvas color it's you know it's a power color it's just uniquely beautiful on its own black is good so you can implement black in furniture pieces or cabinets or you know um, coffee tables or even um, a wall you can you can cover up or give yourself a very good wall treatment in one one wall in the space and go black you know it's something you can find me on Instagram I share amazing tips there as well from every now and then find me on Facebook where I'm slowly or we are slowly creating our community here of design lovers and tip tips sharing lovers right here on youtube facebook and instagram so please do subscribe again share this video like this video give me some love and then drop your comments questions or additions to this video see you next time